The Type 996-911 GT2 was replaced by the Type 997 GT2 in 2007. The new car was announced on 16th of July of 2007, but was launched during the 62nd Frankfurt Motor Show. It arrived in dealerships from November 2007. The 997 GT2 has a twin turbocharged 3.6 liter flat 6 engine which generates 530 PS at 6500 RPM and 505 foot-pounds of torque from 2200 RPM to 4500 RPM. It has a 6-speed manual transmission and is rear-wheel drive. With a curb weight of 3175 pounds, the 997 GT2 accelerates from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 3.6 seconds and from 0 to 100 miles per hour in 7.4 seconds and has a top speed of 204 miles per hour. That makes it the first street legal 911 to exceed 200 miles per hour barrier with the exception of the 1998 911 GT1 road car which is broadly considered not to be a true 911 due to its mid-mounted engine. Motor Trend tested a 2008 Porsche 911 GT2 and found the 0 to 60 mile per hour acceleration time at 3.4 seconds and 11.4 seconds at 127.9 miles per hour for the quarter mile. The GT2 also recorded a braking distance from 60 to 0 miles per hour of 98 feet and recorded 1.1 G lateral grip. The GT2 made an appearance on Top Gear where it had a lap time of 1 minute 19.5 seconds, which was faster than a Carrera GT by 0.3 seconds. Its appearance differs slightly from its sister car, the 911-997 Turbo, in a few ways. It does not have fog lights in the front bumper, it has a revised front lip, it has a different rear wing with two small air scoops on either side, and it has a different rear bumper featuring titanium exhaust pipes. The 997 GT2 is also different from the 997 Turbo in that it is a rear-wheel drive rather than all-wheel drive. 